Hello everyone and today I'm going to show you the Adonis webhook logger that logs your uh, Adonis loader, admin, um, any commands that they run. If you need the product, the free model is in the description, in the Discord, join the Discord. If you've taken the free model, can you please uh, either subscribe or like the video so I can get a counter on who is taking these products and who is not taking these products. It would be uh, very, very helpful, please. Um, anyway, so we've inserted our project. We can see we get notes. Um, we need to quickly open this. As you can see, I'll talk you through the script. Uh, this is the URL of the webhook. You need this as a proxy, but we'll talk about that in a moment. Run for guests. So if no, if someone hasn't got admin, and they still run fly or speed, etc. Then they will still be logged. However, I've set that to false. However, you can set that to true, depending on what you want. Uh, ignored is the commands that you want ignored. So if I uh, I don't want fly to show up, um, the fly won't show up. However, that's not what I want. Um, here we have the embedded system. This is the title of what you'll get. So I'll give you a sneak peek on what it looks like. The thing looks like this. You get a player, a command run thing, and the color and the name. Um, as you can see, this is the player, this is this, this is the command run, this is the message that you'll get. Uh, inline pretty much just means it'll be side by side. Anyway, now that we've done that, I'm going to show you how to make a webhook. So we're going to go to logs, edit channel, integration, webhooks, create webhook, and then you can type your name in. I'm going to just copy this one. Uh, then come back into the Roblox Studio, paste it in there. However, we need to delete the Discord.com and the HTTP section. The reason we do this is because Discord banned um, webhooks from Ro Roblox, therefore uh, we just need to put a proxy in. Anyway, now that we've done that, we're going to go to open Adonis Loader, go to Plugins, and we're going to insert that into the Plugins section of our game. Then we're going to go into game settings, then we're going to security, allow HTTP requests, and enable studio access to API services. Now that we've done that, we can press play. Um, we can wait for it to load. And um, we can do um, perm ban Tommy123. Now that we've perm ban Tommy123. Uh, well, that didn't work, mainly because I did that too quickly for Adonis to load. Perm bad Tommy, one, two, three. Funnily enough, that isn't a command. We'll just run the fly command. Much easier. Command run, as you can see. Oh, yeah. And the perm bad command has just come through. It was just being very, very slow. As you can see, pretty cool. Everything's appropriately fitting. Uh, on fly. As you can see, game bans take a large amount of time in Adonis. Um, I can do um, nuke, so I'll nuke the map. Now that I've done that, uh, it will not register that because I have just shut down the studio very quickly, but most of the time it will uh, do that for whatever game you're in. And that is it for this uh, plugin. I hope you enjoyed it. Um, I certainly enjoyed making the video, and I'll see you all in a bit. Bye-bye.